Hello everyone, I'm your host, Boss Zombie. Welcome back to Minecraft Story Mode. So episode 4 came out earlier this month, like I thought it would. So, I mean, they've been good at the pace with this. If they can keep this up for their other future games, it would be awesome. As long as they're good, good would be nice. But at this rate, the final episode should be out... End of January, beginning of February. I'm not complaining. Alright. Uh, block in a hard place. I see what you did there. Previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Everything in the universe starts out as just a block. What comes of those blocks is up to those who wield them. And in every block, there lies the potential to create or destroy. Our friends have traveled far and wide in search of the Order of the Stone. And a way to stop the Wither Storm for good. But even well-laid plans can go awry. The strong can grow weak. And beloved heroes can fall. I wonder if Eleanor is always the one that dies. And though some glimmer of hope may remain, threat to this world, to its very existence, is far from over. Oh. Just like that. Where am I? What's going on? What is all this? That awful smell. Are you okay? I, I have no idea. Who are you? Jesse, Jesse, where are you? Say something, Jesse. You gotta go, pronto. We're coming. No way, no way. You found Gabriel? Who's Gabriel? Uh, less wonky, or less talky, more wonky. Wait! We need to get out of here. Holy shit, way. they each grew more heads. So now there's just three of these things. Jesse, you made it! Also, it's really loud. And Gabriel? Did you say Gabriel? Look out! Why are the Endermen here? What are they doing? Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch. I'd be condemning them to death. The Endermen seem to have a plan. what do you think you're doing? These Endermen are running directly into danger. You're putting us in danger every second you just stand there. Oh, that's new. Wrong horsies. Jesse, they're falling behind. Actually, you gotta move faster. She's too sick. This is the best we can do. They're not going to be able to outrun it. Not on foot. Grab we a horse. We find a way to move faster. But we're all going to be caught in the tractor beam. Uh. Can we build a portal? If somebody has the right materials. We don't. I haven't seen Obsidian since the end. Horse. We'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! Conveniently, these horses already have saddles. Oh, that's freaky that they can split and grow more heads. Oh, am I gonna have to tame the horse? Slow down, horse. Hmm. Hey, what about us? Come on, Jesse, we got this. We'll take the reins, and they can just hang on. 
Uh, y'all get Petra. I've got Petra. She's on the side, anyways. Hold on, this might be a bumpy ride. God, those things are freaky. That's cool. Come on, horses. What were the Endermen oh, doing? Do, oh, bad. wow. <laughs> he is. He is the pig. Reuben. That's Everyone weird. follow me! Oh, this is an interesting thing. Jesse, look out! <laughs> this is awesome! Why is it giving me an X prompt? I can't help it. I'm getting horse sick. Why is this this X isn't doing anything? Oh. <laughs> Spider jockey. <laughs> I should stop wasting it's the sword. On us. No offense, but you can use a little practice. First time on a horse here. Oh no, zombie! Watch it! Am I controlling? No, no. Okay. You Some... try to knock me off this thing, Jesse? Sorry. Gosh, damn. Oh, I was in control. I didn't even realize it. Turn around to see if it's gaining. But it's all I can do to hold on. It's gaining. It's definitely gaining. What are the Endermen doing? Oh. Are the Endermen going to try to take it apart? Are yeah, Endermen hostile? Oh, hostile to Wither? Oh no! Jesse, look out! Oh, they're not affected. Endermen, they're slowing it down. Am look I at that! Endermen attack a Wither storm. Endermen move blocks. It's what they do. Guys, come on! We gotta build a new one, like right now. <laughs> What's he doing with the sign? The, the post at the end there. <laughs> Why did he build that little gate? You're screaming in my ear. Sorry. So Endermen are unaffected by the wither pull thingy. Cool. Way to go, Enderman. Is Jesse, this the shelter I made before? Gabriel was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. He might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way he's been acting. I'll go talk to him. Hey, how are you feeling? I, I'm afraid I don't feel much like myself at the moment. Gabriel, it really is you. They told us you'd kicked it. Uh, who are you people? It's me, Magnus. Old friend, don't you recognize us? It's Sora. We've known each other for a very long time. The Wither Storm did something to him. This is actually you mean really that thing we just rode on. No, that was a horse. <sighs> what a terrible turn. This is really me. engaging. Like the first two episodes were not like this. You're the one who rescued me. Tell me, please, what is going on? Oh boy. I remember only blackness. And then suddenly you were there. And then we were galloping. You were caught in the wither storm, trapped. For how long? Long enough that it did this to you. Hmm. It felt like an eternity. It was dark and foul. And I was sure I was a goner. Well, you aren't. You made it back alive. Which is more than I can say for some of us. Oh man, Ellie. For a second I almost managed to forget. You guys talking about Eligard? I just can't believe she's gone. It doesn't feel real. How? How could this have happened? Lou's not just a friend. 
but a member of the Order of the Stone. Hmm. Guys, it was my fault. I'm the one who took Eligard's armor. But you couldn't have known what was going to happen. She's right. Don't blame yourself, kid. I, uh, never blame myself for anything. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is, what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. You were the one in the middle of everything. What went wrong? All we managed to do is make things worse. The command block is still out there, Soren. Blast! And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one weather storm to three! Our plan was a total failure! I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Hmm. Why didn't I destroy that cursed block ages ago? Soren, why didn't it break? The Formidabomb was, like, the strongest weapon imagined. Oh, why are you asking me? Nobody's ever built one until now. Ooh, good <sighs> point. I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? <laughs> you have no idea. That jacket. I recognize it. Lucas always wears that jacket. Hmm. There were other people wearing that very same jacket when I was thrown from the monster. It hurts just to think about. Hey, hey. It's okay. So his old friends? If what Gabriel said is true, I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but hmm. if they were just trapped in the wither storm, Lucas, your friends could still be out there. I know. And that means I I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Well, I suddenly feel really dizzy. Easy, easy. I gotcha. Oh. It's the talkie time. Uh, well, Reuben. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Um, how are these guys doing? I'm not gonna lie, man. But we pulled through worse, right? Have we? How's it going? Tell me, Jesse. Who is this person? He keeps insulting me. One minute I think I'm talking to a friend, the next I'm being made fun of. That right there is Magnus. Everyone knows Magnus. Magnus? Hmm. And how do I know him exactly? I sense we have a history, but I feel I need a little reminder. Hmm. He's your friend. He's been your friend for a very long time. Really? Really? You go way back. It isn't working. He doesn't remember. Talk to him about your past. Something only you would know about. Like what? Uh, it's been so long since we've seen each other. I'm not really sure what would be useful. Talk a little about Eligard. Eligard. Yes. She was uh, really something. Hmm. Smart, funny, amazing with redstone. Heck, she was the one person among us who didn't even oh, need Oh, this is a good the, way to get the, the plot. Didn't need the what? You know, never mind. Point is, you liked her. A lot. Didn't we need what? Did. Thank you for sharing that with me. And Jesse, thank you too. You've been a big help here. I, uh, I need to repay your kindness. I'm not sure how exactly. But I want to express my gratitude. No problem. I'd have done it for anyone. All the same, you have my thanks. Yeah. Now then, tell me more about this Elagard. Man, I don't even know where to begin. Gravel? No. Dirt? I don't think so. <sighs> oh. Let's inspect the chest. Like, maybe get some ingredients? Some leftover cobblestone might come in handy. Yes, yes, it might. Wow, a single piece? Maybe not. Okay. Uh, 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 come on, camera. Uh, talk to them. Petra, how are you doing? Hmm. You feeling any better? Better is relative. 
I just sit here and her eyes move. change color. Breathe. They're like more purpley it's now. Almost bearable. Man, if it wasn't for Ivor, she wouldn't even be like this. Ugh, no kidding. That's not exactly true. Ivor built the Wither, sure, but he couldn't have done it without that skull I gave him. If I'd just taken a second to think about it, all I cared about was getting that stupid diamond. This isn't your fault, it's Ivor's. Who wouldn't do something stupid for a diamond? But without my help, Ivor wouldn't have... Wouldn't have wanted revenge on Gabriel? Believe me, he would have found another way. Still, I'm gonna do everything I can. Petra, Ooh. I know this is. What was that? I didn't press anything. She but just stopped talking. You're too sick to be going anywhere. I'm not that sick. Maybe you should rest in this cave for a while. I mean, it's safe, defensible. If I say I'm fine, then I'm <coughs> fine. If you try to keep going, I'm afraid you're not going to make it. No, no way. I'm not a quitter. We're not saying you are. I can do this, guys. You staying here is the right move. I think. You'll never get better if we keep pushing you. But I want to be there for you guys. I know you do, and you will. Maybe you're right. Yeah, let her rest. It's the right call, Jesse. I hope so. Petra, you sure you're okay? I'm fine, Jesse. I just need to rest for a bit. Okay. Is there anything in the foreground? No. Okay, so Lucas wandered off to the horses. Oh, I can look at the horses. Hello, horsey. Am I glad you came along? Good horsey. Just don't tell Reuben I said that. He might get jealous. Oh, whoops. This was a point of no return cutscene, wasn't it? Oh, wait, maybe I can go back? Yes, okay, let's talk to Lucas. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you, I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead, but if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far, but I can't leave them alone out there. Not with three wither I hate to break up the group, You're right, but... They do need you. The best way to help them is to help us beat that monster. That sounds right. But it just doesn't feel right, Jesse. Lucas, look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. I agree, dude. They do it for me. Same way you'd go back for any of your friends. I can't believe I'm saying this, but if your heart's telling you to go, then you gotta go. Otherwise, you'd be heartless or something. Thank you, Jesse. I'll find them. And then I'll find you again, too. I, I feel like this is going to help in the long run, too. It's like backup. Like, he'll go get friends, they'll rally, they're all builders. Later, Luke. May the force be with you. Or whatever. Wait, no. I need to go back and... Oh, I don't get to talk to Magnus? Sorry, Ruben. I don't really feel like company. Oh. Reuben! What an emotional pig! Wow. He really took that roughly. Reuben! Or, not Magnus. What's his face? Um. Damn it, I can't remember his name. What was the dude that was here? Soren. Don't run off on me like that, okay? God, it's like the fucking end of the world. Oh, jeez. These are all I really don't rough. I don't lose you, you understand? <laughs> I know you've run off before, but things are different now. You've lost too many people already. God, that thing is terrifying. The world needs us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but we have to find a way. 
Ruben's smaller than your normal pig. Okay, well, we'll we'll see what's the dealio with that conversation in the next episode. So, thanks for joining me. Come back, I'll the next stuff up real soon. But until then, bye.